Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So today's video is my Bath & Body Works semi-annual sale haul part two. I got a lot of really great stuff so I'm so excited to show you guys. So I want to start off by actually thanking you for clicking on this video and thank you to all my new subscribers. I've gotten quite a few in the past couple of weeks so I just wanted to say thank you so much and if you enjoy this video while you're watching go ahead and like, comment down below, and subscribe. So first I want to talk a little bit about my experience in the store. If you want to see the candle haul I'll put a timestamp up so you can just fast forward to it but basically I went to my local mall and it actually is a Bath & Body Works outlet store which I didn't even know that there were outlets until I watched Tina Marie here on YouTube and um, she did an outlet shop with her as well and that's when I saw like all the great deals that she had so I figured maybe mine would have them too so um, I did go there and there were a lot of good deals I'll put some pictures up over the screen of all the deals but there was a $1 table 75% off and the first store that I went to for semi-annual sale was just a normal store not an outlet but it did have a white barn and they did have a very small like little square 75% off section but this outlet had a whole rectangle of 75% off and then on the back side it had um, like two dollar stuff and uh, it had a 350 section for like wallflowers and then it had a bunch of 595 body care and then they had um, a lot of old retired fragrances that I hadn't seen in years um, at that store so that was pretty good and I think I got some pretty good stuff that I hadn't seen before so I'm really excited to show you guys what I got so I'm actually gonna show you what my mom got I just think it's interesting to see what everybody else got she got a little bit less than me but I will show you she got the twisted peppermint candle from Christmas and this was part of the $8 candle section which was so cool there was a lot of old ones from fall and Thanksgiving and Christmas from that um, section so she got this one she likes the the peppermint smell she said it would be really good for like her bathroom or her bedroom and yeah so that's what she got and then she did get some hand sanitizers so she got the five for eight in stay magical unicorn petals it's really cute um, and she just got these for gifts and then in the one dollar section they did have these Santa's favorite Mary mango hand sanitizers which I don't know why they do mango for a Christmas scent, but it just smells like mango. It smells very fruity. So she got three of these and these were only a dollar. So really good deal. And so that's all for her haul. So now we'll move on to what I got. So on the back of that $1 display, they did have $2 items and they had the new summer scents of the travel size stuff for $2. So I did end up getting two of these. I got the Body Cream Tiki Bay Island Margarita it's so pretty. It smells so good, like very tropical. Sweet Mandarin, Island Mango, and Sea Salt are the notes. It's really good. And I wanted to get this in the shower gel too, but they didn't have any left. So I ended up getting Bali Black Coconut Sands, which this one smells really good too. It has like a very good coconutty smell. So these would be really good for if I go on vacation this summer. And these were again only two dollars. So next on the 350 table, they had actually some wallflower plugins. So I didn't know if this was 350 or half off, but I asked the lady and it was half off, which I'm still totally fine with because look how freaking gorgeous. So it's actually a wallflower plug plugin. You just put the little uh, refill in there, and then it actually lights up with the candles. So it's really, really gorgeous. And I got it for, let's see, I got it for $8.25, regularly $16.50. I would not have paid that much for this, but it's so beautiful. So this is gonna be really gorgeous in um, my hallway, I think is where I'm gonna put it. Um, yeah, it's just so pretty. And then I had never seen these in person, but I always saw people hauling them and they're these little tester candles. So these were all $2.50 and they had a ton of different scents but I decided to go for a few um, fall scents just because I know that fall is going to come around soon. And once I go through most of my summer candles, I'll want to start burning fall. So I got a few that I was really sad that I didn't get to try last year. I got pumpkin clove and it's just white wax and it says clove buds, ground cinnamon and fresh pumpkin. It smells like Hobby Lobby. It just smells like Hobby Lobby. 
It's so good. Um, so that one, and then I also got Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin, and it's like this burnt orange. It's so pretty. This one smells really, really good. Harvest Pumpkin Clove, Vanilla Cream, and Brown Sugar. This one smells a little more like cinnamony than the last one. The last one was more like Red Hot's kind of cinnamon. This is like bakery kind of cinnamon. So this is gonna be really good. I'm gonna be excited to burn these when fall comes around. Okay, and the last few things are all through candles. So I did find the one that I was looking for at the other store, Cinnamon Sugar Donut, and they had it here. And this was only 50% off, but I knew that I really wanted it. It is fresh ground cinnamon, sugar crystals, and Tahitian vanilla bean. Now I really couldn't smell this. I was smelling things with my mask on, and usually you can smell them, but this you really couldn't smell, but I knew that like all those notes sound really great. But even when I burned, I burned a little bit of this last night and I couldn't really smell it. It does, like when you sniff it up close, you can smell it. And I really only smelled cinnamon. So I'll probably wait and burn this more towards fall. I really just smell like a little bit of cinnamon like very very light so I don't know how I feel about that but it does smell really good when I just smell it right here so I don't know still happy that I got this half off so the next one I got was only eight dollars and it's the cinnamon caramel swirl candle from Christmas time and it's gooey caramel grated cinnamon vanilla bean and maple brown sugar this one's so beautiful I love this it kind of smells like um, cinnamon rolls to me but that might just be because of the packaging, like, oh, it's so pretty. But look, it has a little cinnamon bun right there. But it does smell really, really good. And then the lid has the cute little villages on it. So that one is fun and I'm really glad that I found this. And then the last one that I got is another $8 candle. It's blessed, but it's actually pumpkin pecan waffles. So again, I was thinking ahead for fall. Um, why would I want to buy them full price at fall when I could get this for $8, which is cheaper than even like on candle day, which is $8.95, so, or $9.50. I don't remember the prices, but. So pumpkin pecan waffles is maple syrup, golden waffles, pumpkin spice, and brown sugar. They had a lot of the like Thanksgiving um, candles in the $8 section because I guess people were like done with fall by then and they just wanted to move on to Christmas scents. Um, but yeah, so I got this one. It just smells so good. It smells like waffles. And I really, really get a very nutty scent from this, which is the pecan, but it smells so good. I don't know if I can wait till fall for this one, but yeah, so, and this, isn't this just like really gorgeous packaging? I'm so happy to have this. So that is my entire haul from my annual sale. And this was my second trip and I probably won't be going back. Um, I don't really need anything else. <laughs> so praying that I won't go back because I don't need to buy anything else. But I did get some really good deals and I'm so excited. So thank you so much for watching. If you went to semi annual sale or you ordered something online or you're looking forward to getting something, then let me know down below in the comment section. And if you saw any of the stuff that I got that you love, let me know. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.